Demi Slayer is actually right around the corner guys and so far we have five characters that's confirmed in Demi Slayer, Hinokami, Capitan and I feel like this is the perfect time to say what characters that I would like to see in Demi Slayer. What's good YouTube? It's your boy Kuro and this is my all characters prediction list for Demi Slayer, Hinokami, Capitan. Let's get right into it. So to state the obvious already, um, I I'm going to list out the five characters that's already confirmed in Demon Slayer, you know, Kami Captain. The first one that we have is Tanjiro, Zenetsu, Nizuko, Inosuke, and Giyu. Those are the five characters that have already been confirmed in the game. But the other Demon Slayers that I have on my list, the first character that I'm going to start off with is Sabito. He was the one that actually got Tanjiro to the next level where he needed to be. Next on my list we have Kano. I know we haven't seen much of her um, fighting style in season one of the anime but I feel like CC2 can definitely work with this character based on the portfolio that they have done in a recent past with the Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm series specifically Ultimate Ninja Storm 4. They had manga characters that wasn't actually animated in um, the anime yet but they still had characters from the manga that wasn't animated yet in the game and they had whole move sets and everything so i feel like they can definitely pick the ball up and capitalize on that with her and just a whole bunch of other characters but my last demon slayer of the bunch is definitely um as far as season one goes re and goku based on um what we seen in a movie and um i know he got introduced at the end of the anime um we get to see more of him in um the actual demon slayer movie all right moving on to the demons on the demon side of things first character i have on my list is susamaru the volleyball chick you know what i'm saying with the volleyball sauce yahaba the swap demon that um tanjiro was fighting at the beginning of demon slayer um i feel like he'll have an interesting move set like because you know he fights underwater and stuff so i'm really kind of curious how they're gonna um implement his uh fight style in the game or something i feel like in his combos and stuff he probably like do it um in the middle of his combos he probably go up on the water and then you know come back up finish out the combo that way next up we have tamayo i did want to say something about her moveset too as well like she would have like a interesting moveset as well like um i feel like she'd be more of a like support type of character because you know she got the blood scent and um her scent reminds me of um, the perfume from Naruto Ultimate Ninja Storm 4, Karen. Um, her support, if her support hits you, she actually poison you. So like this almost like a, a damage boost in a way because you, you attacking the character and they losing um, health because of the poison. So I feel like her special moves will work that type of way in my opinion um you guys let me know what you think i don't know i feel like she would be pretty cool in the game as well um next up i have yashiro the spider demon mother kayoga the drum demon um he's another very interesting one wonder how his um moveset will operate in the game as well i don't know i don't know like this it, yeah like some of these characters is they really gonna have to have you know a lot of creativity when it comes to building around their movesets and stuff based on what type of moves that they do in the actual game. Uh, next on my list, I have in, <laughs> I do, I, I'm going to keep, I'm going to keep a G with you, Chief. I do not know how to say this man's name. Um, <laughs> in Muyu? So I think, I think that's how you say it. Um, rel I'm still getting relatively um, new to this character because I haven't actually read the manga yet. So, and he kind of got introduced at the end of um, season one but I feel like he'll be in the game as well, nonetheless, because Muzan told him to go kill Tanjiro, and if he did, he'd get some more blood, so definitely we're gonna, he's gonna have a big encounter with Tanjiro, trying to kill him, you know how it go. So yeah, he's gonna definitely be in the game as too, as well, I hope. <laughs> um, last but not least, Rue. Rue is going to be in the game without a doubt, 100%. Come on now, like that's when my boy Tanjiro was fighting against him and you know he unlocked his fire breathing style with him because he pushed him to that level and plus it's like one of the biggest moments of Demon Slayer in season one. So he has to be in the game. As far as DLC characters goes, I'm gonna say that for another video because I wanna wait till you know some of these characters slowly get um, confirmed and stuff like that. 
and also I actually have to go to read the manga so I just want to know for myself you know I don't want to um, <laughs> toss out some stuff that I don't know myself so yeah but that has been my prediction video guys um you guys let me know down below in the comment section um do you agree with my list do you think i should ha have added somebody or should i add it more to the list definitely let me know down below in the comment section leave a like on the video and also one more question what character are you going to be maining when this game drop like any of these characters that i listed um in this video let me know I think for me, it's definitely, I don't know, it's between many, like, but I think I'm gonna go crazy with bringing Goku or Sabido. I ain't gonna lie, Sabido, he just so, oh, he just so clean. Like, when he was first, when he was first fighting with, um, Tendro, he was not, he was getting my boy to work. He was like, he was on, he was on, he was about that, he was about that. So, I ain't gonna lie, I, is it him? I ain't, Giyu is pretty cool to him, getting, Giyu is, uh, one of my uh favorite characters as well but i don't know for me yeah i definitely have to be ring goku so uh, yeah let me know down below in the comment section don't forget to leave a like on this video subscribe turn on post notifications because i will be covering this game doing discussions updates and showcases of the gameplay on this channel